Morning guys, welcome to Jameson's Trains UK and welcome to an episode of Jameson's Railway Adventures. For today's episode I'm going to go to the Vintage Bus Tour around Glasgow. When I say Vintage Bus Tours I mean it's like a museum's tours and things like that. But I'm not interested in the museums, I'm more interested in the bus. So yeah, it's a variety of... Can I say? There's a variety of uh, different uh, vintage buses in that, and I think they've actually made a bit of an effort this year. I mean, last year was good, don't get me wrong. But uh, you had to get the buses for all over the place and things like that, and um, it was mostly 50s and 60s buses that ran last year. This year, all the buses start from the transport museum, well kind of based at the transport museum, so that's where I'm going to be going. So yeah, there's one bus I found out is running, it's a Volvo Elsa, so I'll be after that. And I'm hoping a Leyland Atlantean running as well, which is both uh, built in the 70s. So yeah, definitely a Volvo Elsa is running because I've seen, seen Glasgow Vintage Vehicle Trust uh, posting photos right about them. Yeah, anyway, I'm actually hoping this filming session goes well because from the last uh, Vintage Bus event, due to like, camera faults and uh, people people that tag the language were behaving inappropriate, very very immature. I'm not going to mention names but yeah I'm just going to be a wee bit picky who tags the language now and I really don't want to do that but unfortunately it has to be I'm sorry. But anyway forget about that Onwards and upwards and um, hope for a good day because it does look uh, very good. So yeah that's basically that so I'll give you a wee update um, since we're in you know, Kawaran station of Glasgow Central. But I would say Glasgow Central because uh, I need my own sausage. And if you're an Englishman I not mean like sausage. No, 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 no white links, squared sausage. And if you're from Mercia, you, you call it a roll and slice. <laughs> Just for, like you know, before some of you dirty-minded folk thinking otherwise, no. And that's giving me the dry bulk. But anyway. Onwards and upwards. Here's to a good day and I will see you all in a wee bit. Alright guys, uh, just arrived in a party. Uh, I'm actually an hour early. Um, but yeah, I'm heading towards the uh, Riverside Museum to catch uh, vintage buses. But like I say, I'm about 55 to an hour early. So, yeah, we just jump on the, the first bus, whatever. but yeah, it's, it looks like it's going to be a good line up today. So, yeah, can't wait. But anyway, I'll give you a wee update. Alright guys, a, a wee quick update. Um, successfully filmed three journeys so far. And there's the last bus I came off of. You cannot be a good old Leyland Atlantean. Anyway, I'm not sure what the plan is, but we've done all three routes on three buses that I'm after. Fourth one uh, is a Scotland, Scotland Street Museum by a, a, a Gill Street in City Centre. So I'm going to see what's on that, and we'll go from there. But anyway, three journeys filmed. Better get some more done. It's about it's about one o'clock last time I checked. So 
Anyway, I'll give you some right, guys, uh, back in the city centre. Um, managed to film another journey on a dilemma, whatever it's called. It's an old uh, copy bus. But yeah, we're heading down to Central Station and get the train back to Kawan and so yeah, give you a wee update what you know okay. Alright guys, uh, we're back in uh, Glasgow Central and uh, this will be our train uh, heading back home. 388 uh, Um Yeah, I had to get ho I have to go home uh, early because my parents are on holiday. So that's the issue. The joys. They don't want me staying out uh, late when they're on holiday and I can't go to the pub. <coughs> Annoying, isn't it? But anyway, um, I'm going to get a Vindaloo curry. They did not tell me I'm not allowed one. So Vindaloo curry, it is. So Chelsea Griffin, I'm coming to see you. Nah, I blew that chance. <laughs> but anyway, 388 110. I'll see you soon when we get to Kilwinning. Alright guys, as you may notice, we've just arrived at the Kilwinning and now I'm just going to walk down to the takeaway So, I'll give you the final update as soon as we get back into the house, so I'll see you in a bit Alright guys, uh, that's us back in the house and this will be the final update from today's episode All I can say is, what a fantastic day, I have really enjoyed that Glasgow Vintage Vehicle Trust uh, have really made a bit of an effort this time. Don't get me wrong, last year uh, Museums Tours was pretty, it was good fun and all, various routes, but the issue is, I wouldn't say it's an issue, but they've only used like buses that are built from the 50s and 60s and that, but this year, um, They've actually based all the buses from the Transport Museum. Unlike last year, you have to, sometimes you have to go to uh, Scotland Street to get buses from there to uh, the Borough Collection and the uh, Resource Centre. But this year, everything is based from uh, the Transport Museum. And the plus side is some of the routes. Well, oh, okay, the borough collection, that was not there this year, but that shut for a couple of years. But the Nat Hill Resource Centre, the route for that, we go via the M77 uh, to there, so we get a bit of thrash on a vintage bus. And then um, the route via Govan, um, the Clyde Tunnel was used, again good for thrash. And then the buses themselves, it was like a mixture of 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s. The newest bus uh, they've got running was the Dennis Trident, but I didn't really bother with that today because um, they still get plenty of them running on the road. And to be honest, it's not... I like them, don't get me wrong, I like the Dennis Trident's LX400s. But... Um, if it's like a vintage bus event and that, I wouldn't want to use a Trident because they're still running and they are a bit modern for my liking. But again, don't get me wrong, they're nice and flashy, so I kind of complain with a Trident. Right, like, like actual bus service on this day and age. So, um, I got my Vindaloo, which is sitting in the kitchen. What has made it a bonus this time compared to the 26 is everyone actually behaved themselves. The f I've, there's no reason for me to lose videos. I had to refilm one particular journey which is the resource centre one because um, it was the first journey I filmed like, from today but there was an, an accident on the M77 and we, we got it 
kind of held up right in a way and then we actually went past the uh, cash car so yeah made the wise decision to refund the journey because at the end of the day we don't know what happened to the occupant in the cash car and to be honest it just got to show a bit of compassion a bit of respect in a way so yeah wise choice and plus I filmed it as I mentioned earlier, I filmed it from the side window and then when I refilmed the journey, I used the back window above the engine, obviously. So, wise choice, Mr. Jameson. But, uh, anyhow, I'm freaking starving. That vindaloo smells so good. But I promise you, I will do the vindaloo on a 158, but not today. Today I'm just going to have a chill out night. As my parents uh, asked me not to go to the pub and all that, so that which is fair enough. So what I'm going to be doing is going upstairs, chill out, have my bandaloo, watch films, things like that, and then jobs are good. And so, um, don't know what will be in the next filming session because I do need to start saving money, and uh, either Tuesday or Wednesday coming up. I'm be going out with my friend Chelsea. So again, Chelsea Griffin. Oh, that's how she says I. But yeah, she's been what the poor ass has been working uh, for the past uh, couple of weeks, and that it's a good time I try to treat treat the lassie something and that you know. I've not made the money obviously, but just try to find her something. Oh, woman, is it all hard to please? Yeah, no made of money, but you might go see a woman. Sometimes too much demands. And the neighbours of yours can shut the fuck up. Twats. Right, anyway, I'm going to end the episode here. I uh, hope you've enjoyed that one. We back to banter again. It's a really enjoyable day. All the journey videos, as usual, linked on the description below. So have a look through them. And that's that. So I'll see you on the next episode. Don't know what the plan is. But I'll see you in the next episode. So bye for now.